Hey guys, good afternoon. And I'm wandering around Rome in Italy. Oh my god, look at this guys. It's huge and it's beautiful. And there are some Barbie adverts on it, as you can see. This place is called Palazzo della Patria. Ah uh, no, Altare. I've been walking for some time now. And at this moment I will be wondering what food I'm gonna eat. But I have no doubt that you know what to eat in Italy. So instead, I was thinking of tracking down some places to sightsee. We are here in the center and it's really busy. I didn't know what the day of the week. And behind me I have Altare della Patria. Crossing the road in Rome, you have to make sure the cars actually stop. Yeah. <laughs> you just go anywhere? Or you just go? And motorbikes. Alright, so at the moment we're following someone who's actually wanna go shopping. But according to the experts, the three most important sites to visit are the Colosseum, which we were there a few moments ago, the Pantheon and the Fontana di Tres, which is a fountain. And the other one, the Pantheon. So we'll see you there. So we just got to this place called Ristorante, of course, this is a Ristorante. And we're so hungry, so we need to pick up some pizza. And maybe a sandwich, no, just a pizza. We the first milestone of today, and that's the pizza. I've got some salmon, some tomatoes, some lettuce, some cheese, some sauce, of course. Oh my god, this stuff is really good. Padre Pio. So we just came to the Pantheon, which is this. And there's tourists everywhere, and a fountain, and myself. And we're going inside. Okay, so what it is, is this place. You go in for free, but of course, since it's free, everyone wants to go in. So there's only a, an amount of people they let in at one time. And you need to wait like this. Like these people. Now entering the Pantheon. And look at the hole. So when it rains, when it snows, when it's everything, it just falls down. Here. Pretty impressive. Yeah, she loves it. Well, uh, you can't. If there's rain and snow, it blows in. And that's why it's famous. No, and what? Who wants everything in here? No. That's why it's famous. Is that a hole? Uh, there is no glass open. No glass open? Okay, Pantheon. Done. It's known to be one of the most preserved ancient Roman buildings in all time and that's all I know and I've been inside well bam One for what? What? five dirhams <laughs> they knew how does he know Parmigiano Reggiano Giorgio Gelato Fontana di Trevi Okay, we're at the Fontana di Trevi and she's taking a selfie. It's actually quite big, you can actually go down there. And I don't know what the statue is. This guy is very happy with his selfie sticks. This Chinese woman leads the way. Guy is parking into the zebra crossing. It's 7:20 p.m. The sun is still up. It's going down. We are walking in some random street in Rome. I was going to say Milan. <laughs> this is uh, Cello Cello. Serving. We're looking for a bar to have a nice beer. Cider. If everybody agrees to it. 
I mean, if you are in Rome and you don't drink wine, I mean, come on. We're walking back to the train station to get to the hotel now. It's been a nice day in Rome. Something I've noticed about Rome, there are loads of trash bags on the street. I'm very impressed. At least it doesn't go on the floor. Uh, there's a lot of people, it's only a Wednesday and there's loads of tourists on the road. It's very safe. There is police everywhere. To the bus stop, but because no. the bus is not it's coming. Not, I know, I know, I have to go there. I'm not gonna take some photos and we're gonna go have some pizza, go back to Dubai. And I'll be going to Manila next. Manila, the Philippines. Yep. First time in Manila. It's a monument of celebration. Something tomorrow. I'd rather eat chana masala. Skip dinner. Skip dinner and have like a massive breakfast. Yeah. Like breakfast, lunch and dinner together. The god of birds. Sovik aka Salik. Can you imagine? What is Salik actually? Let's say toll. Toll. So I think that you need to pay in order to stay in a country. Number one. Number two yeah. is, uh, you know, in order for transportation to pass from one uh, road to yeah. another or from one uh, city to another, you, ne you need to pay a certain amount of tax to the to what to, to the country where we're staying. To tax ourselves to commute into certain areas. And um, in fact, in fact, even taxis, right? We form any sort of transportation in Dubai or anywhere in the world. And um, yeah, and it's not of a great amount. It's 